<laughs> Back up, your head's in the way, it's fucking the apples. <laughs> I'm bobbing for apples. <laughs> you gotta go up. <laughs> And action. Hey everybody. Hey Welcome everybody. Back. Welcome back to the homestead, Two Turtles Homestead. We are here this weekend and we are headed out on our second annual trip to Carver's Apple Orchard. We're going to get some apples and we're going to be canning apples this weekend. Come with us on our adventure. We're talking. Let's go. Oh, you'll match. We do that from time to time. Aww. So Jim's in his truck. He's headed to Lowe's because he's got to stop and get a culvert for the pond because we're having our pond restored. So we are off and we're going to meet him at Lowe's. So here we go. The leaves are pretty and the colors are really pretty. Jim from Lowe's. Hi, everybody. And then we're headed to Carver's from the beautiful town of Newport, Tennessee. arrived at Carver's so let's go get some apples okay you want to get the buggy oh just chatting I thought they did breakfast too maybe they didn't we'll get we'll the first that's right excited about our apple haul. We are 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. So we got some Jonah Gold. We got Granny Smith. Carousel. And Arkansas Black. We got some turnips. And then these are uh, Fuji. Fuji. Fall Fuji. Fuji. And this is a variety of apples. What's in Ambrosia there, Jim? and Carousel. going to be cold storage. Back up, your head's in the way, it's fucking the apples. <laughs> you gotta go up. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I'm stealing this apple. I'm st stealing this apple because I want it. They're not, they look so pretty because of the rain. Kyle Carver started his orchard in Cosby, Tennessee back in 1942, but the Carver family has been growing apples in Appalachia for six generations, arriving in eastern Tennessee in the late 1700s. Some of Carver's heirloom species date from the American Revolution, including one grown by Thomas Jefferson. 
Carver's Apple Orchard first opened in 1942 when Mr. Carver began hand grafting and planting apple trees in what was once his cornfield. The orchard now sits on 75 acres, boasting over 40,000 trees and 126 varieties of apples. You won't regret a visit to Carver's if you're in the Smokies. Is it almost time to eat? Uh, so ready. No, I'm ready to. Chicken livers. You know what? I saw the prettiest trees when I went up to visit Justin Aspen trees. Because the leaves, they like shimmer almost. So it's almost sparkly. Like it's almost like a sparkly forest when the wind blows. Because the underneath of the leaves are like a shade or two lighter than the top part, which most leaves are, but those are the way they like shimmer in the wind. They're really pretty. Carvers for keeping their family what. business a family business. Yes. Oh. Neil and I are wrapping these apples for cold storage. And so we are picking out the best looking ones with very few blemishes. And we're wrapping them in this butcher paper because we don't have any newspaper. And we're putting them in this paper bag. These are our, our Fuji's and the Jonah Golds. And then over there in that box we have Arkansas Black and, don't leave that, Arkansas Black and Carousel in that box. And then Camille's got one that still has the leaf on it, which is mm -hmm. awesome. You can leave it on or take it off, it doesn't really matter. I think it'll look cool. It'll be a surprise. That's a lucky apple. That's right. Session here, marathon. <laughs> we are currently processing carousel apples, which are a crossbreed between red delicious and golden delicious. And they are pretty delicious. Very delicious. Mm -hmm. So we're just gonna pan apple slices in a simple syrup. Soaking in lemon water to keep them from turning brown. All right, so we've moved on to the Arkansas Black. We've ha we have seven and a half pints of the carousel in the canner. Just finished processing. Letting them sit for five minutes, and then we'll be pulling them out of the canner. Uh, seal up and then we'll get them labeled up and now we're moving on to the Arkansas black
Arkansas black. And these are the carousel. So we'll get them labeled up tomorrow and see where we are. So thanks for hanging out with us this weekend and sharing our adventures with Camille. It was sure fun to have her here. Um, we headed over to Carver's and had some fun in the apple orchard and picked a whole, or got a whole bunch of apples and we were able to get some uh, apple slices canned up in simple syrup. We made some apple pie filling and then I have all of this applesauce to get labeled up and put into the pantry. So uh, thanks for stopping by and if you like our content we hope that you'll subscribe to the channel and follow us along on our journey. You never know what adventure we're going to go on next. So until then we'll see you. Bye bye.